Okay, this one is uh, a quick one for our senior member, Para Handy, special one. He asked um, how to um, edit quick shapes. So we're just gonna have a quick look at quick shapes and I'll try and keep this as uh, short as possible. Okay, you select the quick shape and I'll create a quick shape on the stage. Um, and this was actually about creating spokes in wheels. So obviously if we want spokes, we want stars. Um, we can alter the number of spokes. We'll make it nine, say. Okay. And then he said, how do we get from there to spokes? Thing is, with quick shapes, you can hold down. You can select any of these nodes here. And I'm going to select this node that I'm not just hovering over. I'm going to hold down the control key. And I'm going to pull that in towards the centre. You can see then that it makes a, just let me deselect it a minute, makes a very slim star. I'll undo that. Um, you can actually, without holding down the control key, sorry, quick shape select, without holding down the control key, you can actually pull it down like this and it will, it will spin the whole thing around if you see what I mean. It's not being constrained in its movement and you can get that effect so with the quick shapes it's an ideal way of altering things all together not only that you can actually also alter the um, curve at the moment that's a straight line but if I just nudge that up I can create that as a curve and nudge that one up there on that edge I can create that as a curve so you can carry on as much as you want just messing around with the shapes, changing all the exterior and interior nodes and their internal and external lines. And you can even take it to such extremes where you, you get like this and you get very different patterns that uh, you're after. But that's what you can do with quick shapes. And I hope that helped. Anyway. Thanks for watching and I hope that helped Norman.